Hi and welcome to my next video. Today I have for you my huge collection of hair forks and hair sticks. This has been highly requested for a while and I'm finally showing it to you guys. I hope that you can enjoy this video. Let's get started. These I purchased at a grocery store near me. These were the first hair sticks that I used. This is what it looks like. They're actually chopsticks, but you can use chopsticks as hair sticks as well. I have these beautiful hair sticks that were a present for me and I wear them all the time. I love them so much. I love them. They have designs on them. They're just so pretty and I love these little guys. I do tend to wear hair sticks and hair forks all the time since it's a really great way to wear your hair up without causing a lot of damage like using hair ties. Here are two more hair sticks that I have. These are hair sticks with really pretty designs on the end. These were a present from a lovely lady. If you're watching this, hi and thank you. I also have these chopsticks. These were a gift as well. A lot of these are gifts, are, were given to me by friends, but not all of these, but these ones here were. These are very nice, high quality chopsticks, which I use as hair sticks. I also have these little hair sticks that I purchased at Michael's, which is an arts and crafts store. They don't sell hair sticks, but I did find these bamboo lollipop sticks. These are perfect sticks for when I oil my hair and do a deep conditioning treatment because I don't really care about these. These are really, really cheap, but they work very well. I got these for about $2 for 30 of them. These are meant as a stick for a candy apple, pretty much. These are not hair sticks, but I use them as hair sticks when I oil my hair and I love them. I have these similar ones that I also purchased at Michael's. They're cookie sticks. And it looks like I've never used them before, but I just take them out on the end like this. See, <laughs> I could put my hair up so quickly with these little sticks and they were really cheap too, but they work. I mean, they're good for when I oil my hair and I don't want to use a nice expensive hair stick. I'll just use one of these little cheap ones. These are beautiful hair sticks, which I purchased on Etsy. They are made of rosewood. These are very pretty for a very simple updo and I chose rosewood since it was the color that matched my hair the most in the picture on Etsy. These were gifts from Noodles Dumpling. I'll leave a link in the description box to the haul for these little guys. These are really pretty hair sticks and forks from her. Here is one where the end of it is like a stained glass window. So pretty. This one has an arrowhead at the end, and this one here has a real shell on the end. She knows that I love mermaids and anything related to the ocean, so she picked out really nice ones for me, and I love her for that. These are some forks that I put in my hair. If I'm oiling my hair and I just want to keep it up, these are really cheap ones that I bought on eBay. These are made of metal, but they do bend, so I can bend these if I want to which I really like because it makes it very easy to use. This is another hair oiling hair fork. This is made of plastic. Whenever I use my henna infused oil on the length of my hair for half an hour, I will use my plastic hair fork since henna doesn't really like metal. So I will use my plastic one. This one I purchased on Etsy. Etsy is very good when it comes to finding beautiful hair forks and hair sticks. They're all over Etsy, which I love. I also have this little guy, which I wear all the time. And usually when I wear a hair fork, it's this little guy since it's very travel friendly. And because it has three prongs, it's very, very firm hold on my hair. I also love the color. This one I absolutely love because it has four prongs, so it's an extra firm hold I found for my hair. I like these kinds because my hair is thick and if I want to keep my hair up all day without any fuss, this one keeps it up very well. It's also incredibly beautiful as well. I did purchase this on Etsy as well. These ones I have, they came in a beautiful box which I kept because it's so pretty. These little guys. I purchased this on Etsy as well. You might notice a pattern where I got most of these from Etsy. As you might be able to tell, I absolutely adore hair sticks and hair forks since it makes it so easy to put your hair up really quick and there's minimal damage involved. This is a hair fork. I bought it because it says Ireland on it and I am part Irish so I decided to buy it and I really, really like it. I did buy it on Etsy. It's literally a hair fork, a fork. As you can tell, just the end of the fork is taken off. 
This one's not so great when it comes to holding up all of my hair. If I made maybe a little bun at the back of my hair, kind of like Belle, she has half down, half up hair, this would probably work for that. These ones I purchased at a Hong Kong supermarket, which if you know me well, I love going to culturally specific supermarkets and stores. The beauty section or hair section is very different from any typical American grocery store. I like to see what they have in their stores. I can't read what it says, but these are metal hair sticks. I also have these really pretty designed wooden ones. So that's pretty much it for my hair stick and fork collection. I hope that you guys could enjoy this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. I hope I get to see you again next Sunday.